Right, okay, question number 12. We've got to keep our wits about us in this one because we've got, this is like a combined mean question, but it's kind of slightly the wrong way around. So there's counters, some are in bags, some are in boxes. Okay, so we know the mean number of counters in everything is in all 30 bags and boxes combined. That is 14. So therefore, we know that the total counters is going to be 30 times 14. Actually, how many counters there are? Well, three 14s are 42, so that's 420 counters. So there's 420 counters overall. Uh, we can work out uh, the counters in the bags, because we're talking about the bags here. So the counters in the bags, similar calculation. Uh, the average number was 10 in it, the 18 bags, so we know there was 180 counters in bags. So, uh, the counters in boxes is just going to be the difference between those. So it's 420 minus the 180, which gives us 240. So there's 240 counters, uh, and they're all in the boxes. So to find the mean uh, number of counters, counters in a box, we're going to take the total number of boxes, uh, total number of counters, the 240, and then there were 12 boxes, 240 by 12 gives us 20. So we think there's an average of 20, no, there's an average of 20 uh, counters in a box. Mark says there's, uh, that number's four. So Mark is wrong.